<laughs> How many inches is this thing? Wow. We are here with Samsung's CHG90 Super Ultra Wide Gaming Monitor. This thing costs $1,200 at full retail price. I've seen it a little lower on Amazon at $900, I believe. But I've been using this thing for about a month or so, and I've absolutely loved it. It's really, really cool. <laughs> the thing is, I've been hoarding it, and I think it's only fair that a few other people over here at BI uh, give it a shot. I feel like I'm at an IMAX theater, but you're controlling everything. It almost has this like 360 feel to it, even though it doesn't really go all around. I'm not trying to do as much cursing as I usually do when I play it. When I play it. No. So this monitor itself, like I feel like I see things definitely more clearly, but everything also on the screen seems very vibrant. <laughs> this is too much perception for a video game, I feel like. How do you go back again? W-A-B? Oh my god, I'm dancing again. <laughs> How do you, oh, no, no. The rocks, the houses, you can even see stuff in the distance a lot more clearly too, which is also kind of important because there's a lot of people who like to use sniper rifles in this game, which is hard to, <laughs> hard to defend against. <laughs> no. Well, that's pretty much uh, for it, <laughs> Well, I lose. I've been using this monitor for about a month or so now. So I'm a little bit more used to this monitor than a lot of people who've been playing. I'm like really nervous. Oh my god, the graphics on this are unreal. Yeah, it's this is incredible. <laughs> it sucks you in. I'm like having a hard time talking. I mean, this monitor looks phenomenal. <laughs> Strangely enough, this is a 1080p monitor, which means it's 1080 resolution. That's not as sharp as 2K and 4K, which is what a lot of people, you know, they would want those monitors. This feels super intense. Like, really, really intense. I'm a little spooked. I can, it's, oh. Oh no. Sorry, rip. I like how realistic everything looks. It feels like as if I'm actually here just, you know, pulling the shots. Very intense game. There's no bezel in between. There's no, you know, shifting from one side of the screen to the other. I think the curves on this display really help. I mean, the graphics on this are really nice. Might be playing The Sims on this. That'd be something. Would you pay $1,200 for this monitor? Yes. <laughs> yes. People spend like $3,000 on their computer, so $1,200, that'd be sick. Yeah, I'd spend it. For $1,200, not sure if the experience is worth it. So I personally wouldn't pay $1,200 for this screen. Maybe it's because I'm just not a big gamer or whatnot. I just feel that for the average person, it's and you know, the average gamer even, it's just a little too high. I just don't think it's, it's practical in that price range.